Who's there? I know someone's out there. Show yourself, coward. Hmm. That looks good. I wonder who put that there. Hey, where's that dog? Shh, keep quiet. Ooh. Hello, my beauty. <laughs> the bone works like a charm every time. Come on, let's get out of here. Who are those guys? Oh boy, I'm really in the doghouse now. It's December again. My dear friend, I haven't seen you in a little bit. I bet you I just can't forget all the fun when we were young. We caused some trouble here and there while we were playing in truth or dare. Lights all around me flashing red and green. My whole family gathered round the Christmas tree. I don't care about the presence of food. I heard something downstairs. Columbus, it isn't Santa. Christmas is still a day away. I know. This is something else. I sense danger. We're not watchdogs. Nobody's robbing the house. You heard that, right? Yeah, but... Uh. Do not fear! Young maiden, your hero has arrived! Wait. She's trapped in one of these packages! <laughs> Poor thing soiled herself! Quick! Before she runs out of air! Columbus. It's a doll. Huh? Uh-oh. Bone, what did you do? Busted. Sit down, baby. Mm, yes. He brought down the whole tree. It was savage. Opened all the presents. Nope, we call this here. The Nerf Bazooka? Are you kidding me? My parents have gone mental. Might have been canceled the whole holiday. Not that it would matter that much. There's barely been any snow this year, so it doesn't feel very merry anyway. I'm telling you, Hunter, this is going to be the worst Christmas ever. Dylan, a moment. I'll catch it later. Thank you. Um, look, I'm sorry, guys. But Bone can't come with us to Grandma's house this year. She's getting too old, and we can't risk Bone knocking her down or ripping up her furniture, and he's been acting wild lately. So he's going to stay at the kennel, and that's how it's got to be. I, I have to put my foot down. I, I am the boss. I am the head of this household. But, Dad... But 
we just moved to this house. He's gonna freak out. Well... Yeah. Uh... Guys, it's only a week. Bone will be fine. Those kennels are like prison camps, mean, brutal mutts. I hear if a dog enters a big house wearing a sweater, he'll get shanked. Won't he be lonely? We will be back before he even knows we left. And Columbus will keep the rest of us company. Okay, I guess. I hope Bone packs a sharp chew stick. Now, we have a long drive ahead of us, so get washed, dressed, and pack up. And don't leave any food out for the mice. I don't want this house destroyed before we have a chance to destroy it ourselves. Oh, and use the shower downstairs, please. The hot water knob is still broken. This house has old pipes. <sighs> Moving on out. The faster we get to Grandma and Grandpa's, the faster we get eggnog. Yay, eggnog, eggnog, eggnog. What's eggnog? <sighs> I'm so sorry that I ruined Christmas. Got a few bad dogs and a newspaper to the nose. No biggie. I can handle it. But aren't you mad you're not going to Grandma's? Thought this was just a time out. I'm going to miss the big turkey dinner. I'm the worst brother ever. Look, you're just new here. You don't understand our place. Don't try to be something you're not. A hero. Yeah, I know. I just thought... You see a beware of dog sign outside this house? No. That's because we're family pets. Our jobs are simply to fetch the paper and take them on brisk walks. You're right. And from this day on, I promise to never act like a watchdog again. Intruder! I got it. Are your Guys, bags ready? hurry up. Come on, are your bags ready? Oh, happy holidays. Hi. You must be the new owners. Yes. Yeah, I saw you had a hold on your mail, so uh, here. Really? Yeah, I saw you moved in the other week. <laughs> Got a uh, pricey looking package here for you. Somebody stayed off the naughty list this year, I see. <laughs> <laughs> Dylan, a package from Uncle Rich. Uncle Rich, you shouldn't have. <laughs> Worst Christmas ever. <laughs> Thank you. I wasn't sure it would get here before we left. Left? Oh, yes, we're going upstate to be with family for the holidays. Oh, fantastic. Would you like me to hold your mail for you? Oh, no, that won't be necessary. If you could, just leave any packages on the back porch. You got it, Mrs. C. Thanks. Oh, and this is for you. Uh, is that a tip? I, I can't accept any tips. Well, it isn't exactly a tip. No, no, no gifts at all, okay? Postal policy, seriously, I could get canned. Well, I wouldn't want to get you into trouble. Just knowing that your family will have a great holiday is reward enough. Well, thank you. Jake. Jake. Happy holidays to you and yours. Mm. I'm ready to go. What a weirdo. I hope the rest of this neighborhood isn't this creepy. That's because he's a postman. No, it's something else. There's something fishy about him. True, he reeks of fish and body spray. It's disgusting. I can smell him from here. I'll keep an eye on him. Stop with the macho yipping. Jake is nothing more than a smelly, harmless creep. How's everything going back here? Sweet as sugar. $20 from Aunt June. Uh, and for Billy, a stick of gum to do something special with. Score! Gift certificate for Chuckle Cheese. We have our Christmas Eve dinner. Yeah, we're cleaning out the new house tonight. Aw, thought we'd go caroling. Kid with the bike, two o'clock. I think I 
I saw this place on that police show you and mom like to watch. We're there now. Pretty high security. Didn't see any sniper towers. More of a white dog collar prison. But daddy, does he have to go? Yeah. Well, um, mommy, what do you think? I love Bone just as much as you do, but he was bad. You wouldn't like it if Dylan opened up all your presents. Right, like I care about Little Miss Wet myself. Now give him one last hug goodbye. We need to get on the road. Be good, bro. See you, bud. All right, buddy. Be careful in there. Come on, Bone. Merry Come Christmas, on. dude. Here we go. Come on, boy. That goes double for you, Columbus. Well, I know it doesn't look like much, but, well, we'll see. All right, buddy? Hello? Hello? <laughs> Save yourselves. No tag. You're it. <laughs> oh. Dog poop. You gonna clean that up? No, I, I'm, I'm covered in dog poop. Hey, how you doing? I'm Anthony Anthony. But my friends, they call me, uh, Triple A. Uh, I'm good. <laughs> What's the other A for? Other A? Well, you said Triple A. Oh, yeah. I can see how that's confusing, yeah. So, who's the little guy? Oh. Bone. My wife's name was Bone. Really? I'm just kidding with you. <laughs> you know what? It's too hot outside. Why don't we go inside? Come on, man. Come on in. Watch yourself. Watch this, guys. Go on, on play. Come here. Here we go. Bone. So, how long in for Bone? Well, uh, just a couple of days. Yeah, I had called earlier, but you seem really busy, so. No, this busy, this isn't busy. Sometimes I have five times the amount of animals in here. Five times, but. Sir, look, I, I can see you're hesitating. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna give you $10 off. Oh, it's not that. $30. You know, you seem like a nice guy. $6? I, wait, $6? I'm bad at this, sir. Look, you seem a little overwhelmed, so come on, Bob. Give me. Look, sir, I, I need this, okay? I love dogs. I love dogs more than I love people. I understand times are tough, but a bone is family. And he's like my family too, man. I I'm gonna treat him like I treat my little brother, and I love my little brother. Most of the time. But, sir, look, I, I love these guys. I play with them all the time. They don't go hungry. We just have fun. We play. I treat them like they're all in my house. I'm not throwing in some cage in some boarding house somewhere. I know this doesn't look like your fancy dog spa with the fancy dog food and the massages and. Huh? Massages? Sir, I've been doing this for 23 years. 15 weeks, about nine hours, 15 minutes. Oh! I forgot to tell you, I'm on TV. You you have a TV show? Yes, I do. Well, I kind of, I have a show. Well, no, not really. See, it's not a TV show, but it's a TV show. There. Oh, a surveillance camera. Yes. Then you can you can take that and you can you can plug it into that the worldwide internet you know contraption. In fact, my little cousin, I thought he kept sending me all these free movies. Turns out that I'm in them. Hey, Mom. Woo! I'm on TV. Hey. You know, um, I don't know. Sir, please. This is Christmas. I will take very good care of Steve. Bone. Really? He looks like a Steve. Look, sir, I don't have children. But these guys, they're like my children. All of them. I love them all. The fat ones, the, the skinny ones, the, the little ones. I'll take really good care of your daughter, I promise. Yeah, boy. Come here. What do you, what do you think? All right, good. 
Okay. Really? Really. But I get to watch Bone on TV. Yeah, every channel, 364 hours a day. Don't you mean a year? No, he's not going to be here that long. Unless you want him to be, and then I can cut you a really good deal, sir. <laughs> no, that's that's okay. Well, great. Then, uh, then Merry Christmas. Uh, you too. Um, <laughs> all right, buddy. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Okay. <laughs> It is freezing out there. Let's get a little heat on. How'd he take it? Uh, took it like a champ. The owner is, well, he, he likes dogs. Think he'll be okay? I hate to think of him in a cold kennel, sharing a dirty water bowl with 10 other lonely mutts. I'm telling you, <laughs> it's not that bad. All right, guys, buckle up. Okay. Here we go. It's gonna be fun. I'm so sorry, Bone. I'll see you after Christmas. All right, come on. That's it, right in here. Okay, go ahead and go find a mattress you can call your own. And the doggy door is in the back, okay? But just feel free, hang out and chill, okay? I'll, I'll be in the living room watching uh, Clash of the Empires if you wanna come out there and veg out or something. All right, Steve. Hi, I'm... Oh! Whoa, what did I... He's a little spooked, man. From me? I don't scare anyone. Neither does he. Hey, look, I'm sorry. Go away! Sure, but... Go away! Come on, let's leave him alone. Did you unplug all the appliances? Yeah. A and the lights are on timers? Taken care of. And all the doors and windows are locked? Yes, dear. Did you lock your bedroom window, Dylan? Gosh, I hope so. I pray no one steals my awesome new socks. <laughs> hey, how about we stop for a little hot chocolate? Huh? Oh, we're only four hours from your parents' house. Let's not spoil the kids' appetites. Yeah, I can't wait for a big bowl of Grandma's leftover mac and cheese. Mmm. You know what he's right? She only makes a fuss over Christmas Day dinner. Yeah. Isn't this fun? Yeah. <laughs> hey, how about this place? We'll be back on the road before you know it. All right. Even I could use a break from Grandma's stale mac and cheese. <laughs> I miss Bone. Oh, sweetie, let's not start that again. You'll see him in six days, okay? Why not now? Dylan, hand me your tablet. There's no app for Fix My Lousy Christmas. I checked. Bone is holding court. He looks happy, too. <laughs> Told you he'd make friends. <laughs> he does look happy. I wish he could see us, too. So, what happened? Happened, man? To him. Oh, Cupcake. Oh, man, that's a messed up story. He seems angry. He should be. He lost his bite. His bite? He's a watchdog, man. And all he did was watch. One part watch, no part dog. The robbers came into the house, took everything, then left. And he didn't do anything? Nope, just watch, see? Watchdog, not action dog, not stop the thieves dog. Well, not everyone can fight. I know, but he doesn't know that. I know what I know. Oh, hey, Cupcake, I didn't notice you there. I let the intruders get into the house. I lost my bite. I don't have a bite. We all have a bite. Some of us just don't know it yet. So, what happened? 
I've ruined Christmas for my family. As punishment, I got sent here to this hippie commune doggy jail, where they went up to the mountains to play in the snow. Hey, man, don't be so hard on yourself. I heard there was like 200 robbers with big guns and a rocket and magic spells. It was three idiot robbers who smelled like fish and body spray. Fish? Body spray? Yeah. Why? Where do you live? Off Old Park. Why? That's my street. I know someone that smells like fish. Could be the same guy. Of course it's the same guy. How do you know him? He was at the house today, before we left. Hmm. He was casing the joint. Casing the joint? Yeah, he's going to do the same thing to your family like he did to my family. You're going to get robbed, and then you are going to stay here for the rest of your life. I think there's a two-week limit, man. You have to go there. You have to stop them. Stop them? How? I can't call 911. This room doesn't even have a phone. And we don't have thumbs! <laughs> well, what has gotten into Columbus? <laughs> he acts like he understands bone. He does. He hears him saying my family abandoned me. Hey, it's not that. Look, he's made friends to celebrate Christmas with. OK, we'll be back in 10 minutes. Okay. Let's go, troops. Our home is in danger, and Bone needs my help. What's the plan here again? We're hiding from the warden. Who, AAA? He's gonna know we're under here. Under these blankets, we're completely invisible. It's common knowledge. Whoa! Well, he's gonna know we're under here now. Not necessarily. Humans also have a terrible sense of smell. Oh, not this bad. My eyes are watering. For the first time, I can see color. Shh. Don't worry about it. Hey, strange dog, you ready? This is our big chance. I'll make it count. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. No, I have to pee. With the pig dance. Skibbity doo. Nailed it, man. Nailed it. You gotta go out, little guy. All right, come on. We'll go relieve ourselves together. Come on, let's go. Let's go. TMI, dude. TMI. No. You cannot contain us, man. I am invincible. <laughs> You're one messed up little doggy. You know that? Get over here. I got you. Come on. Keep it low. Quiet. My belly's getting scratchy. Ready? Go. I'm tired. Run, Bone, run. Find your bite. Hey, man, you gotta help me get out. My brother's in trouble. Huh? Huh. Hmm? Think, puppy, think. Hmm. Parking brake. Hmm. All I'm saying is, I believe Rudolph's nose glowed because he was raised next to a nuclear power plant. What about Prancer and Blitzen? Comet, Cupid, all of them grew up there. That's why they can fly. <laughs> <laughs> Nearly there. <laughs> Got it. Uh-oh. Oh, dear. Excuse me, you folks driving the dark blue SUV? Yeah, why? Well, it's driving itself round back. 
Okay, the bumper scratched, the window's broken, but we're fine. Dad, better check the policy. The puppy may not be insured as an additional driver. Where is Columbus? There he is! This better work! What's the battle plan, boss? Same as always. Look for small items, easy to carry. Jewelry, antiques, gifts that haven't been opened yet that can be returned for cash. If anybody sees an easy make oven. No. They make little delicious chocolate cake. No. I do all the cooking. No easy make oven. <laughs> Gotta get faster. <laughs> Come. Hey, 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 Dog hey, hey, <laughs> Commandeering this, thank you. Dylan's right. This is the worst Christmas ever. Still want TVs, laptops? Electronics are okay. Sweet. Technically, the Easy Make Oven is powered by an electric light bulb. I don't recognize this van. <laughs> oh, it smells like fish and body spray. Jake! Now most of the police force is off duty, celebrating with their families and such. As long as we don't make a racket, we should have all day. How's it look? We're clear. Let's do it. Come on. Come on. Back, go, go. Go off! Then let's just split and come back later. They're gonna be gone for a whole week. How about we do something fun like go caroling? Today is optimal. We hold on and we wait out the alarms. I stopped them, but why isn't anybody coming out of the houses? Hmm, they must be on vacation too. I've gotta stop them. Bet they'll fall for this. This will help them stick around. This will be a washout. So much trouble for this. Let's heat things up a little. Jumps on these. Hot. 
hot sauce facial wash. Hope this raises their pulses. I think that was the last car alarm. Good. Game's afoot. Remember, play it smart. Right. Play what smart? What game are we playing smart? Seriously, I don't know the rules. Who goes first? Can I be the thimble? Shut it up. Now, Rob, don't break any windows. I'm not 100% sure about alarms. Dude, I'm a professional. I think I know. Ah! Ah! What are you waiting for? Just hold on! Ah. Ah. What? We didn't even touch you. Who, who was that? Something hit me in the head! I don't see nothing. It hit me hard. Okay, we'll get you out real quick, like. Ah! Ah! Who's doing that? Two, three. Stop, stop, stop. What is happening? Slippery soap for slippery folk. I think I need to sit down. Up there, an open window. And there's a ladder. Not fooling around. <laughs> huh? 
How you doing, Diesel? Who's this little one? I can't be. Santa? <laughs> 72 okay. East Oak Park, huh? You're a long way from home. <laughs> Nick, what are you doing back there? Looks like Diesel's got a friend. A friend? <laughs> Let's get you home before Christmas, little one. We need to take a little road trip, Mother. Well, Nicholas, we need to be home. Remember the kids. Oh, they'll be all right. This little one in back needs to be with family. Who are you? I'm Columbus. Why are you here? I'm trying to save Christmas and my big brother. Save Christmas? That's adorable. Where are you going? I'm just trying to help my brother stop some fishy criminals from robbing my family's house. Watchdog, huh? I've done security work. Salvage yard. Nothing like sinking your canines into an intruder's arm, ripping it out of the socket, and, and, and going for the jugular. Now that's worth living for. Uh, that's true. Hey! Stop! You have our dog! They can't hear us! Hey! Stop! We're being chased! If they catch up to us, I won't be able to help Bone! I've got this. Door. At least you won't hurt yourselves there. One bungee cord, one garage door, and one reindeer antler. to work. Thank <laughs> you. 
Sweet bean dip. I shouldn't. Okay, buddy? Wake up! Oh, robbing this house is ruining my Christmas! And so are these mousetraps! Oh, God! This is ridiculous! Where did that dog come from? Why does he have a rope? Good boy. Who's a good boy? Okay, okay. Don't be angry. We're all friends here. We're gonna have to make a break for it. Well, what about Rob? Collateral damage. You won't be missed. You gotta wake up, buddy. Hey, it's a doggy. Be. Just ignore them. Let's pretend we're not home. I think they know somebody's home already. <sighs> Carolers. Hark the herald angels sing Glory to the newborn king He's on earth and mercy mild God and sinners reconciled Joyful Where'd the dog go? He nearly killed us. Who are you calling? My cousin, our family's other civil servant. Wait, Quentin? That psycho? Oh man, that dude's bad news. He's effective and an expert at this kind of thing. <laughs> <laughs> hello, I'm looking for Cindy McIntyre. Oh, hello, Cindy. I have a lead on the whereabouts of hello? your dog. Shush you. Oh, no. Yeah, I understand there's a reward. Uh huh. I want to go home. Uh huh. Yeah, I don't want that. Here's what's going to take to procure my services to find your, uh, bubbles. One case of diet apricot snapple. If it isn't diet, no dog. $200 a day, whether I find them or not. Lunch when I finish the job. And I like the crust cut off my sandwiches. Yeah, you know, it's not a deal breaker, but uh, it's in your best interest that there be no crust. Also, you've got to uh -oh. get the mayor to get off my back and change the zoning in front of my duplex, because I'm getting way too many parking tickets. and. It's what, what, what do you uh, mean you don't know the mayor? Hang on. Happy time, pet finders. How may I help? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Stay put. Don't do anything. I'll be right there. Cindy, it's simple. No mayor. No bubbles. Yeah, well, most of the time it is. But sometimes it's righty offy, lefty awny. Hey, we're having a father son manly moment, huh? <laughs> what do you think? 
Can't wait to enter it in my diary. How I spent my Christmas vacation. Dad showed me how to strip lug nuts and we both shared sickness. Jeepers! Worst Christmas ever. All right, that's enough. I'm trying. I would appreciate a little effort from you. Dad, I think... No, I know what you think. That this trip is horrible and that you're miserable and it's a disappointment. I... Just because you're unhappy doesn't mean that you have to make everybody else unhappy. Dad, look. No, you look. This holiday season is about sharing and caring and, and, and about being jolly. Do you think you can be jolly just for one day? Dad. Hey, let me finish, all right? Christmas is about your little sister. She still believes in the magic. Now, don't ruin that for her. You gotta focus on the big things, not the little things. Now, what did you want to say? Is the spare tire a little thing or a big thing? <laughs> the spare tire is a little thing, but it's a big thing. Oh! Hey! That, that's my tire! It doesn't make sense. Why would a family leave their dog here a whole week? Maybe it's not their dog. Maybe it's a stray who wandered in through the doggy door. I knew the Carmelies had a little yapping puppy, but... Could be they have another dog, a quiet one that keeps to itself. Or... for a living. I'm not gonna do it for measly. Fifty dollars this time. I want sixty. The rest of that bean burrito. It's a chimichanga. So, cuz, I'm not sure what kind of breed this is. Uh, don't, shouldn't be too much of a problem. I don't think he bites or... They all have a bite. Look, I've been doing this for years. And I've seen every form of Canis Lupus Familiaris. You see that there, Chief? Three stitches from a Great Dane who didn't care to be put down. These bite marks here, courtesy of a Chihuahua, angry little cuss named Peppy. Came within inches of cutting into a vital artery. Suppose you get a lot of scars in your business. Nothing like the one that I got here. The mental scar that will haunt me forever. So we was traveling back from the port of Bordeaux. Small, single-engine plane, carrying a cargo of illegal endangered animals. 14 French toy poodles. Was one of poodles endangered? Crash landed in the middle of the Atlantic. 11 men went into the water. Plane went down in 12 minutes. Didn't see the first poodle for about a half hour. 11 incher. You know how you can tell that in the water, Chief? No. By looking from the rhinestone collar to the poofy tail. Huh. Because we're smugglers, no one was looking for us. Very first light, Chief. Doggy come cruising by. Wagging his little tail. Now that poodle, he'd look right at you. Look you right in the eyes. See, poodle's got lifeless eyes. When he's coming, doesn't even seem to be living. Till he bites you. Ocean turns red. And then despite all your pounding and hollering, those poodles come in and they just, they just rip you to pieces. Hold up, wait, wait a minute. Are sure these poodles aren't possibly sharks? I told you, we were carrying poodles. 
Why would we be flying with a cargo of sharks? Yeah, man. Don't ask stupid questions. I've never been so frightened waiting for my turn. I'll never put on a life jacket again. <laughs> Them dogs. They could have taken us all out all at once, but they just let us bob in the waters like we were squeaky toys. See, it's not their teeth that are dangerous. God, it's their mind. They're crafty. And that's their bite. And that's the worst bite of them all. Bite, huh? Wait till you get a load of my bite. How long is this gonna take? Yeah, I kinda need to use the John. Can't go to the dog. You gotta let the dog come to you. Just go. Make it quick. all the action. Uh, uh. We I think we should just go home. Still a little time for caroling. This dog is a tricky one. He's smart. But he hasn't met me. I'm gonna be a a shock to his system. <laughs> I, I don't get it. <laughs> either. <sighs> see how you have this uh, cattle prod and you shock animals with it? We didn't see that. 
Yeah, it's like electricity, high voltage. Yeah, we understand now. Yeah. <laughs> Why don't you boys just stay here and uh, watch a master do his work? <laughs> Poochie, poochie, poochie. Come on, where are you, you little mutt? Think you're smarter than me? Huh? <laughs> Let's turn this baby up to ten. See how smart you are. Come out wherever you are. Come on. Are you my mama? <laughs> what? Are you my mama? <laughs> Baby, have to pee. Why, you kidding me? What happened, guys? We get him? Hey, cuz, you okay? Like a chimichanga, please. Sure, sure, sure. Here you go. <sighs> you okay to drive? Drive, okay. Great, buckle up, see you at the family barbecue. This is taking longer than we planned. I have to get the van back to the fish market for delivery. So find that dog and put him to sleep. Sleep, huh? I got plenty more tricks up my collar. Stuck in a laundry chute? It serves you right, you little troublemaker. Ah! <laughs> Who did that? Was that the dog? Hey guys, I'm stuck. I'm very claustrophobic. Oh, oh I shouldn't have had that bean dip. Oh. 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 One glass. Ornament? <laughs> uh, uh, didn't hurt, dog. Uh, I'm gonna have to try harder than that. Huh. One pointy lawn dart. Uh,
Come rob a house, they say. Oh, steal a bunch of presents, they say. What are you doing in the laundry chute? I thought I lost a sock. Huh? I'm stuck, and there's something really sharp in my butt. Is that Jingle Bells? I thought it was the dog. You thought the dog knew Jingle Bells? Just get me out of here. Stretch your leg up towards me. Oh, the walls are closing in. I just got skewered, and oh, 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 gosh! Give me some warning, will you? Right, hold on. Anybody out there? Anybody? <laughs> Get me out of here! I can't reach you from here! Got an idea. Kind of hot in here. Oh, are you okay, dear? I've worked for the big guy quite some time, mostly herding reindeer. You are so lucky, Santa. What I really want for Christmas is a rawhide stick, a pig's ear, a new tennis ball. Oh, and one of those. Plastic hot dogs that squeak when you bite into them. But most of all, I want my family to have a safe and happy holiday. That and a squeaky hot dog. Okay, we're all good. The spare's on. But now we don't have any dogs for Christmas. Oh, honey, don't you worry. We are going to find Columbus. Casey, don't forget. Bone is perfectly safe and happy. Hello? Guess it is? Listen, before you get mad at me, I just want to let you know there's a perfectly good explanation. The explanation? Yes. What explanation? Um, explanation is why I can't find Steve. Steve? Steve? Who is Steve? You don't know your dog's own name. Are you kidding me? Wait. Is it the wrong number? My dog's name is Bone. Oh! Bone. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> so? Is Bone okay? What happened? No. No, he's missing. What? 
Yeah, I can't find him. I have no idea where he is. You said you were going to take care of Bone like he was your own brother. Honestly, I haven't seen my own brother in eight years. <laughs> I have no idea where he is either. I, you. Yeah. Hey, try pulling. Hey, hey. Ah! You out? Why do I smell barbecue? Help! Help! Guys, I'm getting really pruny in here! Whoa! Jake? Don't ask. Dude, I thought you were a Sasquatch! Hey, we should cut our losses and bail! I, I don't care. Where are you? <laughs> You're a dead dog! This way, boys. Over here, I've got a little treat for you. What? He's right there! Oh, he's a sneaky little mutt. I don't trust him. I'm grabbing him before he gets away again. Come on. A little further. Little further. <laughs> After we clean up your house, on our way out of town, we're gonna drop you off. Off a bridge, that is. <laughs> Merry Christmas, boys. Now fill your bags with presents! Who is it this time? I think it's Santa. Get back. Be quiet. Merry Christmas! How can I help you on this glorious early morn? I believe this little ragamuffin belongs to you. Oh, yes, 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 we were worried sick about her. Him, him, him. <laughs> These guys are thieves. They don't live here. Don't ease all settle. Sweetheart. We got to be going. Of course. Of course, can I offer you anything for a reward? That won't be necessary. I'm just so glad to get him back to those who love him. God bless you, sir. Man. Bye. Take him to the others. Do 
donation has been made in your name to the Fuzzy Pet Foundation. Stop, stop, get in, get in there. Get in, get in there. Columbus, Bone! I bet someone will read his tag and bring him back home. Yeah, you're probably right, honey. I hope Columbus doesn't catch a cold. It's Christmas, and all they can talk about are the dogs. I know. We should have brought both of them. They're family. And family always comes first. I can't believe you did all that on your own. That's an incredible journey. Sorry, bro. I should have listened. We're not watchdogs. We're not heroes. No, you were right all along. All you have to do is find your bite. And I found mine. Your bite? We might not have pitbull jaws or greyhound speed, but we have something other dogs don't have. We're potty trained! No, I mean, yes, but that's not the point. We have a family that loves us, and we'll do anything for them. A faithful and unbridled spirit. Yeah, I've got that. Time to take these guys down. What do you say, little bro? Do you want to help me save Christmas? Darn Skippy! Cry havoc, and let slip the dogs of war. Shakespeare wrote that. Shakespeare? The cat down the street? We've got bite. Let's get chomping. Hey, Diesel, you want to stop for some breakfast? Diesel? Something wrong, dear? That's everything. No, that's not everything. Where are the dogs? Really? They're trapped in the closet. The family will be back for another week. There's any food or water in there. Oh, I know they're gonna die. I just want to be there when it happens. Now go get them! They're gone! I can't believe that worked! Under a blanket, dogs are invisible. Common knowledge. They got out! They got out? How? Maybe he picked the lock with like a wire hanger or something. A, a wire hanger? What is he, MacGyver's dog? Doesn't matter. We got everything. Let's go. Whoa! Puppy, puppy, I'm gonna find you. Ah. Gotcha. <laughs> oh, yummy. Treats for Santa on the mantle. See what we have here. Ah! 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 The signal. You're mine now. Claustrophobic! 
Let's <laughs> turn up the heat. Oh, keep it tight, Rob. Oh, clench it up. Again, I smell barbecue. You know a lot of good tricks. Let's see how well you play the dead. Let's see what you got, Mano Idago. <laughs> Buffing up. You're not gonna slip away this time. I love the piney smell of freshly spilled floor wax. Hey, that's not cool. Ow! 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 Turn it off! Ow! Turn it off! Turn it off! Ow! Turn it off! Now to ring your doorbell. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. Don't get cocky, kid. Hey, do you smell barbecue? <sighs> Take that! Uh, uh, uh. Thank you, stranger. Diesel! Think you can introduce me to your uh, friend over there? I'll see what I can do.
That's a heck of a couple of watchdogs you got there, Mr. Conley. Protected the whole house. I suppose that's true. So one of my dogs traveled cross-country with Santa to meet the other one and take down a ring of international diamond thieves and destroy the whole house in the process. Best Christmas ever! Christmas after all. <laughs> Wait, it won't be a real Christmas without Grandma and Grandpa. Could it be? Hmm? <laughs> Mom, what are you doing here? So that's why there's a German Shepherd here. Diesel's here? Yeah. Oh, so this is your new house. <laughs> Diesel! Oh, oh, oh. Grandma! Grandma! Oh, 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 oh. oh good to snow. see you. Oh. Whoa. I'm glad you guys are here. Oh, it's so nice. <laughs> We're related to Santa? It's a Christmas miracle. Come on, guys, let's go inside. Listen, kid, I've been around a few Christmases. It's true. No way. I swear on my life. All nine of them? Yes. Now quiet. Here he comes. Wow. Magical, right? Where's his claws? It's his jolliness, Rigby. That's why he's so big. Oh! Is that the record Julia wants? How did he know? He is Santa, Rigby. He knows. Hey, I'm gonna tell Santa what I want. Hey, hey kid, where are you going? I wanna say hi to Santa. No, you can't. Santa's allergic to cats. <laughs> well, hello there. Who are you? Hi, Santa. I'm Rigby. Uh, shoo, shoo. Go away. I I'd love to pet you, but I better not. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Ew, gross. <laughs> Excuse me, Santa. Go away. Shoo. <sighs> ah, oh, you made him sneeze again. Go away. <sighs> <sighs> Cookies. Ah, cookies. Bigby, get back here.
Hello? Is someone there? See, kid, I told ya, he's allergic to cats. Santa? <gasps> oh, I can't let her see me! Santa, wait! Mom, Nathan has a tree. Tommy, please. But Mom, everyone else has a tree. Tommy, we talked about this. Inside. Hmm? You're Santa. You're the one who knows all this stuff. Tommy! Don't forget to shut the door or the kittens will get out. Get out? She's crazy. Why would we want to get out? Hey guys, I missed you. Yeah, put the milk away, or it'll go bad. Okay, Mom. Did someone say milk? No, no, here she comes. this. Christmas, it's just something marketed by companies to sell toys and other items they have too many of at the end of the year. Here comes another sermon. I'm out of here. I remember. You know I love you very much, right? And that's why I'm not gonna lie to you and tell you Santa's real. He was made up by a soda company. Look, you have to learn to be self-sufficient, not rely on someone to bring you the things that you want. Okay. Hey, where'd you guys go? That's why when you do your chores, you get an allowance. So you can buy the things that you want. Trust me, when you get older, no one's gonna hand them to you. I know. I love you very much. I love you too, Mom. Hmm, those little rascals didn't leave any food for me. Let's make a deal. I will 
finished putting away the groceries and I'll post my new article. And then you can do your chores, dust the living room, water the plants, and then we go to dinner. Deal? Deal. Are yours this much trouble? You have no idea. Ah, I am bored. We better not go anywhere. It's almost nap time. Quick, get it! Oh, but it's almost nap time. Oh, lighten up. You, you paper towels thought you could escape me. Never! You're right, this is fun. Quick, don't let it run away. I got it! You're through, paper towel! Woo! We gotta make sure it never escapes again. That's it, guys! Nice job, mittens. This feels great on my claws. Ah, it keeps falling on me! Uh oh, it's still escaping over here. I'm on it. Hurry, tear it apart! You're mine, paper towel! Woo! Look, guys, it's almost like we have snow in the house now. Oh, quick, grab it, guys. Not cool, guys. How's it going? What happened? The kittens. It doesn't matter. Just clean it up. They'll be out of our hair soon enough. Kittens, what did you do? Uh, we may have gotten carried away. I tried to tell them, Mom, but they wouldn't listen. Oh, yeah, you weren't the one I saw leaping through the air. Shut up, hairball! Enough! Kittens, you know Tommy and Julia can't always do everything for us. If we can't show them that we can take care of ourselves, they'll... They'll what? <sighs> they'll give you a new home. A new home? No! They can't do that. Yes, they can. Listen to me when I say, we need to take care of ourselves. I picked a heck of a week to quit coughing up hairballs. <coughs> Did somebody say food? Tommy? Always thinking with your stomach. Can you change that, please? Do you think Tommy will put out some food? No, Mittens. Mom says we need to take care of ourselves. I say we find our own food. No more loafing. Huh? No more what? Tommy? Come on, Hairball, let's get that food. Oh, uh, you know, I would, but it's a little high. And nine lives is short if you really think about it. Fine, I'll go myself. Just try not to land on your head if you fall. Whoa, cramp! Be careful, Patches! Uh-oh! Here it goes! Oh, 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 oh no! Oops. Heads up! Incoming! Tommy! Bail! Let's get out of here! Sorry, Patches! Oh, no... I just mopped in here yesterday. Now I'm gonna have to do it again. I'll help you clean up. No. You go outside and water the plants. I will clean up. They probably didn't mean it. I'm sure they were just hungry. I'm sure. Outside, please. And don't forget to close the door. Tommy, do this. Tommy, do that. Why can't you do something for a change?
Guys, I feel sorry for Tommy. Way to go, Patches. Hey, it's not my fault, Mittens. It's always your fault. Shh, listen. What is that? Oh. My. Gosh! I thought you two broke it. We did, yet there it is. It's impossible. It's horrible. It's the devil. Gotta go, gotta go. We gotta get out of here. Go, go, go. Right behind you guys. Hello, Tail. Don't look back. Patches, slow down. Wait. It's still coming for us. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Patches, look out. Ouch. Tim. Tommy, how about we try to keep the kittens off my lawn? And that's my cue to leave. Okay, buddy? Okay. Sorry, Mr. Bramble. I'll help. No, 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 no. That's okay. Now, Tommy, I'm gonna level with you. These Santas have been in my family for generations. Creepy. <laughs> It's not creepy. It's a tribute to the true meaning of Christmas. Sad. I have to tell a grown-up that Santa isn't real. Of course he is. It's OK, Mr. Bramble. You don't have to lie to me. My mom already told me the truth. She did? Well, if you'll excuse me, Tommy, uh, I'm going to have to find myself some super glue. Santa's uh, hang out for a bit. This chair is boring. Let's go somewhere else. Hey, where do you think you're going? No, not the chair. We'll die of boredom. Don't be so melodramatic, hairball. Hey, watch the fur. Let me go! No, no, no. Or you're gonna get in trouble. Hey, trouble's my middle name. Haha, <laughs> you can't get us. Try and catch us now. Hey, watch that fur! Yeah, Mom just gave us a bath! Judge Tommy? Yeah, since when does he hate fun? Tommy? Can you get the door, please? Hi, Tommy. Is your mom here? Look, I'm sorry if I was short with you earlier. It's just those Santas? They're very special to me. It's OK, Mr. Bramble. Your childhood delusions are causing you to revert back to a childlike state. Mm-hmm. Who said that? Mom, she writes about it in her blog. Yeah, I know. Is she around by any chance? Mom, Mr. Bramble's here. Macaroni and cheese? Oh, you cooked. Well, actually, I also came over because I wanted to see if you had any super glue. See, one of my Santas fell outside, and I want to fix it before tonight. All the stores are closed. Why by tonight? So Santa can see them. Okay. There you go. Uh, thank you. You're welcome. Well, actually, 
If you guys aren't doing anything tomorrow night and you wanted to come over for dinner, you're more than welcome to stop Marcus, by. Marcus, thank you. But Tommy and I will be busy settling everything for the kitten's adoptions. Bramble, what is he doing here? It smells like poo. We would have done it Ugh, sooner, but everything's gross. closed for the holidays. It smells like you, Patches. Jeez, you roll in fertilizer one time. Well, let me know if you change your mind about dinner tomorrow. Ugh, right? hey, <laughs> where are you going with that shoe? These shoes really stink. No kidding. Wait, where is he going? Hey, get back here. Look out! No! No! Oh my gosh. I am so sorry. I'm fine. Uh. I'm fine. You got something on your face. Yucky. I'm fine. Better luck next time, Bramble. Tommy, we need to talk about the cats. Mom, they're like family. No, they are family. Tommy, I can barely keep up with the two of us. I promise I'll watch them. We've already had this conversation. Money's just too tight. I can't afford vet bills for four cats. Mom, please. I'm sorry, but you know that they're gonna have to go up for adoption. You never listen to what I want. <sighs> enough to choose whether I celebrate Christmas or not. I bought this after school the day before Christmas vacation. Hey, you guys want to hear a Christmas story? Merry Christmas to all, and to all, a good night. I like that story. Did you like that story? This kid has talent for telling great stories. <gasps> oh no, I want to eat that book. Mm. <gasps> Oh no, the Christmas tree! Is everything okay? Yep, just getting ready for sleep. Tommy, honey, we have to talk about the kittens. Well, good night. Good night. What is this? What's what? That. My Christmas tree? Please don't take it away. Where did you get it? You said people should work for what they want. And I bought it with my allowance. Tommy, I'm glad you understand that if you save, you can get the things you want. But I can't allow you to have that. But, Mom... Tommy, how many times have I told you Santa isn't real? And there's no need to have a tree if we're not going to put presents underneath it. I know, but... Tommy. Go away. Tommy! I said go away. I'm sick of having to act like an adult. I'm gonna prove that Santa's real. Tommy. I said go away! First Christmas? I wonder what you'll take away next. I wonder what Easter's like around here. Poor Tommy.
I built this box for you. I'm going to put you in it. I'm going to give it to Santa. You're going to be nice because he's going to take care of you. I promise I'll never do anything bad again. What? what? No, wait, wait, what? Wait! Ah. Can I even fit in here? I'm going to miss you guys. Maybe Mom will hear us. She can't hear us. She must be sleeping. Oh no, he's taking us to our new home. But we want to stay here. Where's Mom? Mom? I don't want to go. Mom? Mom? Don't worry, I'll get us out. We promise we'll be good from now on. I swear. on my tail. Sorry. Guys, I'll be right back. Does that mean we can get out of this box soon? I don't know. He said he'd be right back. I'm gonna miss you guys. I'm gonna miss you too, Tommy. You guys are my best friends. giving us to Santa. Donner, Blitzen, those Thompson twins almost caught us. What am I doing here? I haven't been here for years. I have no presence for this address. Records indicate Epic up at the site. Please proceed to the chimney. No, no, you don't, I, I don't think there's any presence in this address. Records indicate Epic up at the site. Please proceed to the chimney. <laughs> All right. All right. Come on, tune in, tune in. Tracking node, come on, flip over, flip over. Oh. <laughs> wow, it has certainly been a while since I've been here. This guy needs to lay off the cookies. Wait, oh, is that Santa? It is, maybe he's gonna take us to our new home. But I like this one. Dear Santa, mom, ah, shoot! Hmm? Ooh. Cookies. He gets cookies? Oh, that's not fair. Mom? Whoa. No. Wait. Whoa. Wait. What's going on now? Hey, guys. Where is he taking us? I never even got to say goodbye to the litter box. What's going Whoa. Whoa. Wait, why are we up on the roof? <laughs> That was close. Let's see what we have here. Got a note. Santa. Stop. I gotta record this. Tape. We need a tape. Oh, we 
got here? Dear Santa, Mom won't let me keep the kittens. Please take it. Kittens? Great recital? No. Ballet classes? No. Kittens? No, 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 no kittens. Sharknado? Definitely not. Dad's farewell speech? Yes! Kittens. Kittens. Ah! Ouch! I'm gonna hurl ah! my tail! <coughs> it's terrible. He's not moving. Tastes like cookies. Hey guys, I think we broke him. Let me check his pulse. Psst, up here, dudes. Whoa, you can talk? Whoa, like so can you. Come on, clock's a ticking, little dudes. What do you mean? These peasants aren't gonna deliver themselves, little bud. You have to fill in for the big man. Things just can't get any worse. And then this happens. Come on, I'll drive. You can't even walk on four legs. How do you expect to drive this thing? Oh, hey, hey, fish sticks. Uh, you guys, I can't get in, you guys. Wait. Santa? Are you here? Santa? Hmm, how do you work this thing? Hey, furry dude, <laughs> hit the little red button next to the screen. This one? Hello, and welcome to the Santa Slay 3000. I'm Tinsel. I will be your liaison to the H-O-L-I-D-A-Y. Helpful, omni, longitudinal, international, directional, accurate, Yuletide system. <sighs> system complete with CPS, Christmas positioning system. It appears that the sleigh has not moved in the recommended amount of time and the weight ratio is incorrect. The last call was a distress call. If the last call is incorrect, please select the home button to recalibrate. Otherwise, please select from the following. Santa emergency, sleigh emergency, reindeer emergency. Santa emergency, hit Santa emergency patches. You selected Santa emergency. Please choose from which type. Present malfunction, lack of cookies, incapacitation. Incapacit what? Incapacitation, push the button patches. Remain calm. In case of Santa incapacitation, please retrieve Santa's cloth receptacle if it has not already been located. Then, procure the supersonic aerial vessel and reassure the range of fire triandas are in adequate condition to help aid you on your journey. Santa? The content in the cloth receptacle must be cross-referenced with the most current behavioral scroll. The scroll, or naughty and nice list in layman's terms, can be located underneath the Ariel's vessel. Or Slay's dashboard. I think we found it! Good job, sis. This list features all those who are naughty and nice from around the world. The glowing name indicates who's next in line for content delivery. Just say the name on the list, and the range of fire triandas and aerial vessel will allow you to fly off to your next destination. But remember, you must stay on schedule. All content, presence, must be delivered by sunrise. Sunrise? That's like in six hours. If the younger humans do not receive presents on Christmas, there will be riots in the street and everyone at the North Pole will be out of a job, including me. So, good luck, and please refer to the H-O-L-I-D-A-Y guide anytime you are in need of assistance. Now what? Now let's get the show on the road. We'll have to hurry. 
This is to keep our home, guys. Carrie Bailey, up next. Awesome, Carrie Bailey. So let's go. Whoa, where are the seatbelts? This is amazing. Oh my god. Oh, oh he's leaving. Oh. Santa. Oh Oh God, no, don't leave. Please! Oh, work! Oh, come on! Wait, 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 wait. Slow down! How do you fly this thing? It's going around the other way. Oh, we're gonna die! Stand up! Whoa, where are the brakes? Come on, come on, come on, come on. No! <gasps> Tommy! Hey man, did I ever tell you guys about that time that I did slay out by myself? Man, I was in so much trouble when I got back to the North Pole, but it was sweet! <laughs> Great. They want my one chance to meet Santa. That's not Santa. Those are my kittens. Well, if those are your kittens, then where's Santa? Hmm. All right, let's get you inside. Great. How are we supposed to get the presents up in the stockings? I'm not sure. Mm, I got it. Catapult ready. Fire! Great job. Three pointer. <laughs> yes. All this work is making me hungry. Woohoo! Milk and cookies. Oh, pretty delights. Any tuna flavor? Meow! <gasps> I'm kind of stuck here in the tree. Help! Help! Guys! Come in. Oh, boy. Here we go. We'll get you out. Just hang on, hairball. Don't move. I move. Now the tree's moving. Stop moving or else you'll... Or I'll what? Okay, big guy. Amazing. 
Daisy? Oh, there you are. What's wrong with you? There's nothing there. Fine. But I'm going back to bed. Let me know if you capture Santa. This is gonna be a long night. How does it look, guys? Um, looks good? Hey, I did my best. Hurry, someone's coming. Quick, how did Tinsel say to get out of here? Close. Hey, guys, uh, can we make a pit stop? You'll have to hold it. We have a schedule to keep to. Oh. Santa? Santa? This is made with organic cinnamon essence. There's gotta be something else. working. I'm, I'm sorry, I just, I just can't have anybody see me. It'll, it'll be the whole end of my career. Are you allergic to cats? Why does everybody always ask me that? I'm allergic to a lot of things. Cats, legumes, certain metals, nightshade plants like tomatoes and Peppers. Really? Yeah. Don't worry. It, it's okay. I, it's fine. My mother was allergic to all those things. I, I am too. <laughs> it's genetic. Who would have thought that Santa is such a mess?
Hi, kitty. Nice kitty. Stay. 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 Up. No. No, no. Up, up, up. Don't, don't do that. Get, get, what, what do you do? Ah! Oh! Gotcha! Jeez, fine. Finally. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Aw, oh, man. Gotta go. Can't wait. I'm gonna get all dirty again. Hairball, wait. Mittens, wait. We'd better get adopted to some really nice homes, Santa. I mean, come on. You, look over there. Guys, a little privacy. Oh, oh, sorry. Um... Don't listen to me go. Um, never mind. I'm just gonna go over here. Guys, you, you should take a look at this. We're on a house. Heads up, Mittens, we're coming down too. Ugh, this place gives me the creeps. Hairball, a litter box gives you the creeps. Whoa, look at this tree. Hide, someone's coming. <laughs> what was that? I don't know. Hello! Ah! Oh, God. It's just a nice little girl, guys. Santa. And you're not little. But you are cute. She's starting to freak me are out. Are you thirsty? Could I get a cheeseburger? I'll get you some water. I thought she'd never leave. Okay, we've got to get out of here. Yeah, let's just leave the present and skedaddle. You guys, she could be the one. The one that'll take care of us. Yeah, maybe if you want to end up with a missing eyeball or tail. Did you see those pigtails? I'm back! I brought you some water. And my cheeseburger? I have a bad Come feeling here, about Katie. this. Patches! Katie. No! Like... Come here! Patches! Oh, that's much better. He's doomed. You can live with me now. We'll be best friends. <laughs> we don't have time for this. We have a schedule and to keep. We still have a lot of presents to be delivered. We need patches. We must do something. Dress you up. Nope. 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 That one's horrible. What's she doing to him? Listen, I have a plan, but you're gonna have to trust me. Perfect! Hey! Ow! Aw, poor kitty is sick. Kill me. Oh no, my other babies are sick too! You guys need rest. Two of you have been sick, and one of you has been a very naughty kitty. This is humiliating. But I still love you. Come on, Pedro. Good night, my kitties. Oh, guys, a little help, please. <laughs> You look cute. Okay, not funny, guys. I think she's asleep. Maybe we should stay. She seems to really like us. I'm a prisoner. Get out! Okay, let's make a break for it. Run, 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 run! Where are you going, my kitties? Ah! Run, 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 Get run! Run, run! Oh, my shadow! An 
I did not look cute in that dress. <laughs> Gotta hurry. There's only a couple hours left till sunrise. And we still have half the country to go. Ha! Ha! Oh, cute! I say we keep them. Yeah, let's get them! Nope, not playing dress up again. Let's get out of here. <laughs> get them! Let's go! I'm coming! Are we done yet? Not even close! Oh, man! Now who's next on the list? <laughs> One for Ashley. And one for Rachel. <laughs> okay, got it. Uh, run, there's a dog. Ah! <laughs> Hairball, stop playing around. Thank you. Starting to get hungry. On your mark. Set. Go. where my reindeer and sleigh are. I am on a tight schedule, you see, and I've got to get caught. Get away from my son, you shopping mall crap! Wait, wait! I'm Santa Claus. Oh, sure. And I'm Kate Middleton. <sighs> Stop. Put that down. Watch. That's just a magic trick. You had a candy cane what? in your other hand. Watch that. Hmm? Nice try. <sighs> Tommy, go to my bedroom and get my cell phone. No, Mom, that's the real Santa. Tommy, we've talked about this time and time again. Santa's not real. Yes, he is. 
I saw him fall off the roof. Well, now I know you're just making things up. Come on, Santa, show her. Tommy, did you buy a Christmas tree this year with your own allowance money? Do you know where that tree is now? Well, why don't you go look in the garage? You couldn't do it, could you? You couldn't throw away his Christmas tree, could you, Julia? Who are you? How do you know my name? And who told you about that tree? Did Tommy tell you? I'm Santa Claus. Is that so hard to believe? Yes. Ah, there you are. Maisie. Thank you, Tommy. Enough with this phony baloney. I'm calling the cops. Mom, wait. Just watch. Watch. Santa's hat. <laughs> it's real. Uh, Santa? I'm scared. I want to. Well, what's up, dudes? Oh my God. Come on. We gotta get out of here. This is I'm terrible, hungry. guys. Let's find that list. Just stay together. I'm glad you're here. I'm gonna need your help. You were eight years old that Christmas. You had two cats, Baxter and Rigby. And you wanted that 45 more than anything else in the world. What's a 45? It's a record. A what? Do you know what a CD is? A what? Oh, never mind. Julia. The cat scared me, and I stumbled, and I knocked that record down, and I broke it. But you kept it, even though it was broken, because you wanted to remember that Christmas when you actually saw me. Now, Marcus Bramble, he saw me too that night. And for a while, the two of you were inseparable. And you put up with a lot of hazing and teasing by the other kids, because you believed in me. 
but finally you couldn't take it anymore. Marcus could, and he kept on. That's why you hated him, because he could do something that you weren't able to. Mom, I saw the ornament in the front closet. I know you believed in Christmas. Julie, you, you didn't want to put Tommy through that same hurt, through that pain, and so you denied that I existed. But here I am. Your son, he believed in me. And here I am. Santa? Oh. It really is you. Yes, it is. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, dear. But why? Why did you let them tease us like that? I begged and I begged you to bring us proof so that we could show the other kids, but nothing ever came. Julie, Christmas isn't about proof or evidence. It's about sharing in that spirit and spreading the joy. Now, if I gave you evidence of my existence, all that would be in danger. The North Pole, Mrs. Claus, the elves and the reindeer. It wouldn't be very fair now, would it? I guess I have pretty good proof now. <laughs> Here I am. See, Mom, I told you I could prove Santa is real. Tommy. I'm so sorry for giving you such a hard time. It's just, I didn't want you to get hurt. I know, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now that my life is no longer in danger, maybe you guys can help me. I really could use some help getting my reindeer and sleigh back. I mean, it's getting very late. I thought you knew. Knew what? The reindeer took off with your sleigh. Huh? And my kittens. You mean the kittens that were in that box? Yeah. Oh, this is a disaster. It's almost sunrise. My magic runs out at sunrise. If it comes out that Santa didn't finish Christmas, I'll be ruined. Kids will riot in the streets. They'll be, they won't go to school anymore. And the grown wouldn't be able to, Force them to, it'll be mass chaos and hysteria. It's terrible. It'll be a catastrophe. Santa, snap out of it. <sighs> oh, okay. okay. All right. <sighs> oh, way to be the designated driver, Patches. We lost the list. Where are the reindeer? They're gone. You think they'll come back for us? Yeah, right. Those dummies probably don't even know we're missing. Let's find that list. Just stay together. I'll find it. Mittens, wait! Mittens! Who knows what kind of trouble those kittens could be in? But we need to figure a way to help them. This requires some brain food. We have cookies. Did you say cookies? Hmm. A plan to save Christmas. Well, Tommy, I figured out if I could take the Christmas spirit from my hat and add it to some Chris magic. My hat. Where, where's my hat? Ever since that Christmas where Julia and I saw Santa, I've been so sad that she didn't back me up when the other kids made fun of me for it. And I've spent every Christmas since then paying tribute to Santa and trying to prove that he is real. But now, the power of Santa's hat has shown me that Christmas isn't about paying tribute to Santa. It's about loving others and being kind to others and helping those who need my help. People like Julia and Tommy and you and your poor little defenseless babies that are lost out there in the cold of night all alone. 
I can help them. We can help them. Yes, let's go find your kittens. Great, I'm talking to a cat. Mittens, hairball, where are you? Where are you guys? We can't go on without you, List. Come on, where are you? Come on, where are you? Dumb List? Patches, mittens, where are you? I'll never ask for anything again. All I want for Christmas is my family back. <laughs> hey, man. Hairball! Who are you talking to? Uh, nobody. I lost Mittens. I don't know if I can find her. Oh, found her. Mittens! Miss me? Told you I'd find it. What are we gonna do? Our elf support won't answer. We're stranded! <sighs> okay, Maisie, let's find them. Let's see if we can break into the Santa network and stop from where they're going. Ow. Locked. Oh boy, I need some help on this one, Maisie. Nedry. Oh, perfect. Please be home, please be home. Come on, answer. Hello? Nedry, oh, thank goodness, I'm so glad you're home. Listen, I need your help with something, okay? What is it that you need this time? Uh, look, um, I need a favor. Are you on Santa Tracker 10.8.1 right now? I've been on it all night. Okay, perfect, look. I really need your help with something. I'm trying to break into the Santa network so that I can help the sleigh. Can you help me with that? Why do you need to break into the sleigh? Uh, look, it's a long story. I'll tell you about it later. But just please, if, if you'll help me, I'll owe you big time. All righty, but you're going to owe me big time. Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate it. <sighs> it's cold. I want mommy. How are we supposed to deliver these presents? How are we supposed to get home? Get this. Get this. Bramble? And Mom? Get closer so he can see you. Oh, there you are. It's me, Mr. Bramble. With Maisie, your mom. Look, I need you to listen and do exactly as I say, because we're going to try to get you back home, okay? Now, the sleigh has backup rockets. I can activate them from here, but you're going to have to do the steering from the sleigh. Think you can do that? Rock on! Let's go home, Patches! Hang on! Remember, you have to steer! Oh, no, no, left! Mom never lets me have cookies at night. Santa, would you like some cookies? I was allergic to peanut butter. You never said that. I did. I was allergic to legumes. Oh. I killed Santa. 
Tommy, go grab the EpiPen. It's in the first aid kit in the bottom of the cupboard. Hurry! <laughs> Santa, hold on. Hurry! Nope. 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 <laughs> Santa, it's gonna be okay. You're gonna be okay. Hurry! <laughs> Nope. Hold on, Santa. It's gonna be okay. You look great. Hurry! Ah, got it. Tommy, hurry! I'm going, I'm going! Found it! Hurry! Whoop! think there's a man that can take millions of packages around the world in a night I can't even drink any water or find my way home it's almost sunrise I can't believe Bramble's the last name on the list I know weird huh the sun is rising hairball do you see Bramble's house yet what are you talking about? They all look the same. Kittens better hurry. When the last snowflake falls, it's over for the year. All right, Maisie, they're getting close. We better get ready for them. It sounds like my sleigh. This is Kitty One coming in. I think I'm gonna be sick. Wait, they're going to Bramble's house. And he hates the kids. Oh, go, go, go. Exactly what it looks like. Marcus, uh, get, get up. Come on up, boy. Come on up. <laughs> Give us our kittens back. No, 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 no. I, I can explain uh, that. I can explain. See, what it happened was is I... I, <laughs> I love you. I found oh, Santa's hat, and then I found Maisie. And Maisie and I, we hacked into the Santa network. And we saw that the kittens were on the sleigh, and that the sleigh was lost. So we got up and we got into the sleigh through the GPS, and then we redirected the sleigh back what? here, and then we found the kittens in here. And I was, they're, they're so cute. Look at them. I love them so much. I love them so much. Look at it. Look at them playing with each other. Ah! Sorry. Ah! <laughs> what is wrong with you? Do you want like a hot shower or some Vicks? No, no, it's or... the cats. I'm allergic to them. Uh, <gasps> ah! <laughs> oh. um, Sorry. Can I... I'll be right back. Boy, is he a couple of bricks short. Kittens! 
kittens, you had me so worried. I took care of us, Mom, just like you said we should. Oh, kittens, I know what I said, but you are still my babies. Never think for a second that I will ever not worry about you, no matter how strong and self-sufficient you become. I'm your mother. I will always worry. I love you guys. We love, love you, you too, too, Mom. Mom. Self-sufficient, what? Uh, too many big words for me. Oh, that's not... Thank goodness you guys are okay. But what about Christmas? Aren't there still presents to be delivered? You're right. Bramble's the last house. Here, Santa. Oh, thank you, Tommy. But it's empty. There aren't any presents left. My magic's gone. It's completely gone. And if I can't deliver this last present, it'll be gone forever. We have to do something. Tommy's right. Mm -hmm. Christmas just can't be canceled. I thought you hated Christmas. I don't hate Christmas. I just, I didn't believe in it. But someone gave me a reason to believe again. <laughs> Thank you. Does that mean we can celebrate Christmas next year too? Of course it does. Yes. <laughs> but that won't matter if we can't deliver the presents this year. Couldn't we give Mr. Bramble cookies or decorations or something? Hey! Listen. Whoa! Smooth landing! Whoa! Another perfect 10, bro! High hoof! Cool! <laughs> Here, Santa, I think this belongs to you. Yes, it does. Thank you, Mr. Bramble. Merry Christmas. Is there anything I can do to help? Help us? I thought you hated us. Besides, you can't give a present to yourself. You stopped talking to me. I wanted to reach out, but you never wanted to talk. I even started following your blog. How do you know about my blog? We've been neighbors since we were little kids. And ever since we stopped talking that one Christmas that we saw Santa and the other kids were making fun of us for it, I hated the fact that I lost my best friend. I connected with you the only way I knew how. I'm sorry I stopped talking to you. It's just that it was too painful to be reminded of. That's why I started putting all those Santas in my front yard. I figured maybe if you saw what Christmas was that you would believe again and I could have my best friend back. Without your help, Christmas could have been ruined forever. Glad to help, Santa. <laughs> and you guys. I couldn't have done it without you. <laughs> Tommy, tell me what you'd really like for Christmas. Well, what I really want is for the kittens to stay with us. But... 
Mom said we can't take care of them. But that's what I really want. And I'll save up my allowance to help pay for them. Well, I'll take the kittens. I could use the company, and that way they can see Maisie anytime they want. Really? Really. Do you guys see what I see? And this is for you, little mm, ones. Is it my cheeseburger? <laughs> Thanks, guys. And here's a little token of my appreciation. This is the coolest thing ever. And this is for you, Tommy. Thanks, Santa. Merry Christmas. I think you know what this is. Thank you. <laughs> Marcus? This should help you get you in touch with your inner child. And you won't have to wait so long to get it recharged. <laughs> Come on. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, Santa. <laughs> Merry Christmas to you all. I have to go now. It's getting rather late. Goodbye. Travel patterns indicate clear weather. It'll be smooth sailing all the way back to the North Pole. Welcome back, Santa. Hello, Tinsel. <laughs> Santa. Wait, I have an idea. Why don't we take a picture of us? <laughs> Everyone say Merry Christmas. Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas.